Have you met a woman? We are rivals who inspire. Anyway, if you meet her, will you? Perhaps this means nothing, but do you ever get the feeling you're being watched? I do. Welcome. Merci beaucoup. If I have the ingredients, I can make... However, it does take time. Should you want... Welcome. Oui? Can I help you? If I have the... However, it does take... Should you want, please come and see me again. If anything catches... Come back anytime. Are you lost? Gracious me, where did you come from? If you're that jumpy, maybe you shouldn't wander out here at night. I'm not wandering. I'll have you know that I'm pursuing science. Important science. Yes, I'm on these planes for a reason. I'm here to learn more about the breeding habits of the fuzzy sheep. Look, you're dedicated. That's great. But is it worth dying for? There are monsters out here. Yes, I know. It is believed that fuzzy sheep mate only at night. I've tried on a number of occasions to track them back to the breeding grounds, but each time... A marauding monster has driven me away! I've been forced to make my observations from this distant spot, so as not to endanger the sheep by attracting more monsters. However, it is dangerous work. That sounds foolhardy to me. I accept the risks. And do you mind? I have work to do. Unless, that is, you would... care to help me. Maybe, but you're putting yourself... Oh, I... But I have no choice. The whole of science eagerly awaits my results. Why don't I make the observations for you? I can keep the monsters away at the same time, and then let you know what I see. That sound good? But... But... Very well. But what choice do I have? Monsters seem drawn to me like flies to a pile of behemoth dung. As far as I can tell, the fuzzy sheep spend the night amongst the ruins atop that hill. I hope you will meet with more success. I'll do my best. No. Fine. I shall await you. Do this. Eyes to the future. What's your most valuable treasure? Evil has a price. You think you can be forgiven?
you can do. like an egg. It can't belong to the sheep. What do you have there? Is it an egg? What are you doing out here? I told you to wait for me in Arius. I couldn't just loiter around the village, twiddling my thumbs and waiting for you. You could have been killed. <sighs> but now that you're here, you might as well take a look at this. I found it in one of the sheep's nests. What do you make of it? You did? Are you sure it was a sheep's nest? Let me see. Gracious! Could it be? This is incredible. I do believe you have found the first verified fuzzy sheep egg. A sheep egg? You're joking. I mean, that's impossible. Sheep don't lay eggs. Oh, I assure you, it's entirely possible. As a scientist, I can tell you that many kinds of animals lay eggs, not just birds and reptiles. For example, monotremes are mammals that lay eggs. Although I admit they are decidedly uncommon. So, it's all clear now. That's why the sheep return to the same place every night. They have to sit on their nests and incubate the eggs through the cold night. These are the sheep's nesting grounds. Yes! It's the greatest biological discovery of the century! Here, let me have the egg. I shall guard it with my life. If I can keep the embryo alive, and a fuzzy lamb hatches from it, it will be the final incontrovertible proof of my discovery. The decades of work and self-sacrifice have at last borne fruit. Thank you for everything. If I can keep the embryo, the decades of...
stopped. These days. Thanks. This will have dragged other people into helping me with this. So I can't back out of it now. I am going to visit Dr. Sheep right away. Once you collect it! Yes? What can I do for you? Nothing. I'm here to help you. Here, I've brought you these. Are these? Are these what I think they are? Yes! All the natural ingredients I've been searching for! This will advance my research immeasurably. I am in your debt, young lady, whoever you might be. You really don't know who I am, do you? No, I'm afraid not. Should I? Have we met before? I am terrible with people's faces, you know. Now, if you were a sheep... I guess it's not you after all. You can't be Deet. If you were, you'd surely remember me. Did you say Deet? How do you know my real name? Wait, are you... can it be? Are you Tilda, my sister? Deet, it is you! I knew it! Just a second, you two are long-lost siblings? You're actually Dr. Sheep's sister? Yes, yes! We got split up hundreds of years ago. It happened back when the chaos first poured into the world. I never thought I'd find you out here. I mean, when I first saw you, I couldn't believe my eyes. It was so long ago, after all. Yes, I could say the same. Why, I'd long given up hope that you were still alive. But I don't understand. Why didn't you come to me right away? I was afraid. I didn't know what I'd do if you weren't really my brother. No one knew your name, either. Everyone called you Doctor. So, I just waited. 
Until you found an excuse to approach him. Yes. Although if I had to be totally honest with myself, the fact is, I was just putting it off for as long as I could. It's your fault, Doctor. Now how could you forget your own sister's face? But... but I didn't. I mean, I did, but I thought she was dead. She looked familiar, but I had no reason to expect my sister to be here. It was inconceivable. Deet, I looked for you for so long. And I too, dear sister. I'm sorry. I should have known it was you right away. It's all right. I'm just so happy that you're alive. I can't believe it. It's... it's like a dream come true. Dearest sister, it's been far too long. We have a lot of catching up to do. the train. Go ahead and board the train. 